for a long time. I was afraid of her. I kept her out of my house. I kept her at distance. I thought I could. But recently I started noticing her again and again. During daily walks in old Delhi and she became more familiar. Fear reduced to excitement and curiosity. A gentler pull. One day I invited her to my house. I do not remember letting her into my bedroom though. But now as I s sleep, I breath a mantra I do not know. And she gently whispers secrets on my hands and thighs and everywhere. What I feared and tried to keep at a distance was already inside. Shadows that I have tried to hide from myself and others. Acid green jealousy, dark red rage. Shadows sometimes projected elsewhere. I look at her, dark skin, wild hair, tongue out. She stands firmly on the ground. She will teach me to stand like this. And I will stand like this when I need to. But for now, since I can, I remain here on my back. And she, she looks at me with all that I am. Shadows on what shines all of me. In her eyes, I. And beautiful. With her, I become beautiful. She lifts me up, she has raised me. Loving her, loving me, I have nothing left to fear. Ecstatically, we die.